In today's video we will be joining our friend Vanellope on another adventure in the quest, Boss Up. To unlock this quest you will need to reach level 7 friendship with Vanellope and have unlocked Ursula and Anna. Once you reach the requirements, simply chat to Vanellope to start the adventure. In our previous quest we had to complete some fun gaming levels and Vanellope thinks we are ready for the next big step in any good game, which is to take on the boss and defeat the villains of our story. She's going to prepare us to face off against three valley villains. To get us through our epic adventure we will need to first create some potions that will help keep our energy up during our long battles. Once we have our potions ready we will face our first foe, the Sea Witch Ursula. For the first part of the quest you will need to create three potions which are, Raspberry Boba Tea for healing, Mint Boba Tea for strength, and finally, Coconut Boba Tea for agility. Don't worry if you don't know these recipes yet as she will give you the recipe books, simply open your bag to use the new recipes. Once you've learned all of them and collected all the ingredients you can head over to your closest cooking station to prepare the potions. First up I made the coconut boba tea, which requires coconuts, you can find these on Dazzle Beach, then some sugarcane, seeds for these can also be purchased on Dazzle Beach and lastly you will need milk which you can purchase from Remy's restaurant. For the mint boba tea you will also need sugarcane and milk as mentioned before. Mint can be found in the frosted heights. And finally, for the raspberry boba tea you will need to collect some raspberries in either the plaza or the peaceful meadows. Head back over to Vanellope to show her the potions you have made. Then we can head over to Ursula's home to battle our first boss. Once you've entered her home you can chat to her to start the big battle. I love how she calls Vanellope the squeaky little creature. Ursula has no time for our silly little games. I feel like Ursula always gets the short end of the stick with quests like these. First it was Stitch bothering her and now it's Vanellope. Once you're done with your battle head back over to Vanellope to let her know how you fared against the evil sea witch. She loved the battle and thought it was absolutely amazing. But now it's time to prepare for our next big battle and for this we will need a weapon. She says we should be able to find our very own mystical sword in the forest of valor. Head over to the Forest of Valor to find your magical weapon. You should spot it stuck in a tree stump. Mine was near where the pillar used to be. 
Once you have retrieved it from the stump using your shovel, you can equip your new gear by accessing the fashion tab. I just love the sword and shield and I'm so happy we get to keep it once the quest is over. Once you have your weapon ready, head over to watch Penelope battle Mother Gothil, they should be on the steps leading down to Dazzle Beach from the Peaceful Meadows. Once their battle is over you can chat to Vanellope. She is disappointed that she did not get any good loot from the battle and she realized that Mother Gothil is just a grumpy old lady living in a tree. She thinks we are now ready to take on the final boss, Scar. She has a plan to lure Scar to his cave and once he has entered we can attack and defeat him. First up we will need to collect the materials needed to craft a lure which should get Scar to enter his cave. First up we'll need one kingfish. These can be caught from blue bubbles on Dazzle Beach, between 6 in the evening and 5 in the morning. Using miracle fishing bait will not help with this quest. Then we'll need to catch three herrings. These can be caught from white and blue bubbles on either Dazzle Beach or the Glade of Trust. Once we have all our fish, we'll need to collect 30 pieces of softwood which can be found in all biomes except Dazzle Beach. And finally we'll need 30 pieces of fiber, this can be crafted from seaweed which can be caught from any body of water, when you fish outside the bubbles. Alternatively you can also purchase from Kristoff's stall when he has them in stock. Then you should be able to craft the lore needed for the quest. Now that we have our lore ready, we can head over to Scar's cave to place the trap near the entrance. Once you have done this you can chat to Vanellope. The lore has worked and we can now head into the cave to face our final boss. I love how Scar plays along, even though it's very half-hearted.
Once you have defeated Scar you can head back over to chat to Vanellope to tell her of your victory. It seems we have unlocked some loot for defeating the big boss, head over to collect your prize. Pick up the item on the ground, this will open up a new memory which looks very much like a treasure map of sorts. You can now chat to Vanellope to complete the quest, Boss Up. She promises more fun adventures are to come and that we should hold on to our newly discovered map. As always if you found this video useful please leave us a like and don't forget to subscribe if you wish to see more content like this. Next time we'll go on our final adventure with Vanellope and it promises to be a magical experience.